What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to Big Bro and Lil Sis Reacts. I'm the Big Bro, this is the Lil Sis. And today we're on Suicide Squad Isekai. This is season one, episode six. And we ended with us confronting what looked like Thinker and maybe Poison Ivy. Um, but this Poison Ivy has fire, so it might not even be her, but I just don't know what the character it could be. Um, it's green fire. There you go, um, it's kind of crunchy. Because she does the blood. Yeah. But the crew restocked, they got their weapons. Um, Flag contacted Waller. She said continue with the mission and take out pretty much the original squad that was sent in. So, and make good relations with the people. But the people don't really like them, but. Mm. So let's see what they got for one of the reactions I read. What the hell happened? He might have an answer. Ooh. Well, he might have had an answer. What do you mean? Wow. Just beheaded him. She looked possessed. Who are those assholes? Ooh. Yeah, let's suit up. Safety's off. Let's do it. Maybe he should give them some intel. Okay, so these are, they're just under control. They look like villagers. Squad is pissed. They're being controlled. I don't feel like they should die for this. You mess with the peace and you mess with me. Wow. We we'll used her as a shield. Mm. Yeah, that shot. Anymore. I think they're probably controlling them. Shark, watch out for you get shot in the ass. Sharks have asses. She really looked like more than I do. Nothing but a bunch of uncouth buffoons, I see. Your lack of intelligence. <laughs> Is evident not only from how you look, but also your actions. First a dragon, now we got a witch and a mad scientist. This place is crawling with circus freaks. Uh, my reputation precedes me. It seems pretty obvious the Empire's found themselves another dumbass. You here to get back at us for what happened to your squeaky friend? You must mean Red Catcher. I could not care less about such a friend. We're trying these sneak attacks. They ain't really working though so far. Your fort has already fallen. I see no point in any more unfortunate bloodshed. This is my you baby character. You with the drama, bitch. <clears throat> You're dead. Nice. The heat is protected. Ooh. Have you seen your munitions won't do it? You resort to brute force, and then you. a surprise attack from a surprise guest. Be smart, y'all are going really after. Get creative. Can become viable soldiers if they all think as one. Open fire. Shark ain't the brightest. Gotta outthink the thinker. Ooh, he can heal. Oh, he can break through her uh, magic bubble. Focus. Gotta find their weaknesses. Shark. Show who the king is. There 
Yeah, he should bend his hand off. Yeah, come on. But it's like fighting a horde of zombies, except they got swords and shields. It sucks they gotta die, because it's like, they innocent. Oh, that was cool. Y'all gotta distract Think our healing. I've never been a fan of guys in white coats. They like to talk more shit than do shit. Oh. So eager to provoke me. Shit. <sighs> this fear of being laughed at. My performance. How could you do something so mean to me, Daddy? Don't leave me! Don't leave me here to die! I suppose it was said. also a wise man who once said, there is no cure for stupidity. Listen, walk away. At least you'll... Yeah, this is hardly what I'm talking about. You're just another ass for the Empire! Our alliance serves a purpose. I have no love for Argus, nor do I serve the Empire. So is she enchanters? Proving yourself to be another idiot. If detonating the implant were possible, you would have triggered all of the moment the other we got separated months ago. My primary orders are to capture you alive if possible. So, you want to test that last part? Hmm? Are you serious? You're not done yet? As you can see, we've wiped out your fortress. I'm see surprised how Killer Croc are at this shark. point. Even with your psychotic woman and untamed shark, <laughs> take some time to plan your next move. It should at least prove entertaining. <sighs> okay, so what and happened? Just left his foot soldiers. Don't even care about. <laughs> Man, dude, he got armor on. He's Wait. made of clay. No and way. Are this you and I really strong. the only ones left? I don't believe that. Hmm. You nailed the sad sobs, top notch, but your pose is all wrong. You need a more intimate head and lap or draped over him sort of thing. What the shit? I'm not sure what just happened, but for some reason the bullets just stopped. The impact did sting a bit and knocked me out. Oh, what just happened to me? Oh. You got shot. We all thought you were finally dead. Huh? Enchantress. Oh, good. She saved well, them. Huh, huh. Did you do anything special with your ammo? Not a damn thing. I heard the news. Sounds like a miserable defeat. Sorry, they were more than we bargained for. I thought having all your nasty weapons made you practically invincible. Oh? No wisecracks or sharp remarks. They're metahumans. Huh. It'd be harder to take Dear them down. God, this is a disaster! Why are the elves doing this? That. How does he command them like this? He's powerful! Not even our knights can use such magic. I see no need for panic. Of course, your majesty, I would never... Uh... There is no denying that we have lost an important outpost. In the end, not much. <laughs> if our knights had simply been in charge of the forts from the very beginning, then this never would have turned into such a setback. Thus, the blame for our losses falls entirely on the one responsible for allowing the prisoners to escape. It also sucks that she's not Indeed. a good leader. Hang them all. Oh! Choosing to rely on uninvited visitors was a terrible mistake. You're doing the problem. Please, fear me. 
Executing the visitors will accomplish nothing. It keeps our military in line. And it will also send a very clear message to the populace. That Not we really. must all protect the kingdom ourselves. That's ridiculous. It may be true that we have been relying on our powers too much. However, putting them to death will not change sense. anything. No. Cecil. Y'all leaders an idiot. My mother once told me She's something. cool and slow. She said that ending the war is the duty of royalty. <sighs> but I can't shake She's so the high and mighty. Get off her high horse. That my mother is letting her anger towards these strangers cloud her judgment. Yeah. I'm not sure whether or not I can trust my own mother anymore. You're just not realizing that? You Ben couldn't trust her. She's terrible. And what yeah, about your personal feelings towards them? Huh? The outsiders. The outsiders. I can't speak for the queen, nor can I fully understand the concerns about her that plague your heart have developed an attachment to them. I would like to know why. I don't know, Cecil. All I can say is, I feel compelled to want to believe in them. I have an idea. I say we break out of here and go kick their asses. It's our fault they're out there causing all sorts of chaos in this world. Our fault? You and Argus are the ones to blame. We only got dragged into this after they sent us to clean up the mess you guys created. They sent the wrong cast and crew. None ways, Bowden. <laughs> we no like to lose. Yeah, you got jumped back. You should probably keep your voices down if you're going to attempt a prison break. Let's go. Are they sending us out to the guillotines? They will if you stick around here much longer. The queen intends to have you all executed. Convince her otherwise. We ain't convinced her yet. So what? This is how you're gonna save us? Yes. By sending us all out to fight for you again? <laughs> Why don't you get your guys to try and beat them first? Oh yeah, cause you'll get dropped again. We all know that. Careful. You and your entire crew fought admirably. But it doesn't change the fact you risked your lives for people who you owe nothing. It would be a travesty to execute you. Huh? My fiance lost her life to this goddamn bloody yeah. war. So Perfect. what about you? Any family or loved ones? Are there no people waiting for you to come back home to them? Good point. <sighs> you, you got a daughter, Lord. You know, I never figured you guys would be such chicken shits. Thinker got into your heads, didn't he? That's exactly what he does. And now you have cold feet because you got scared by all his crazy mind. Hey, shit. Piss off. Please keep your voices down. So you're in on this too. <clears throat> Cecil, we're running out of time. I cannot keep distracting the soldiers forever. What do you say? <clears throat> say ah. All these big teeth you've got. Well. God, God, I was trying to prove a point by yanking out a tooth and telling him that sharks can regrow their teeth, so he should regrow his damn balls too. Allow me, the teeth of yours are able to grow back indefinitely. Go to the right. There's a side passage leading from the dungeon. How's your little brother Noel doing? Is he feeling any better? I know he was sick. Yeah, more or less. But they hiked up the prices on bread and eggs again. War ever gonna end? I don't know. Well, I bet the soldiers must be stuffing their faces anyway. Apparently there is dedicated staff who cater food to them. They follow the soldiers to wherever they're camped. Hmm. That's the military camp. Yeah, that's the poor kid was mistaken for an enemy soldier when he snuck in to grab food. Wow. That's awful. How can anyone expect a shooter? Well, we saw her stand at the grave. No. like a proper member of the royal family. Do not visit the city without my permission again. Once you learn to do what I say, then we will not have any more mistakes. It would be easier to just do what I'm told, but I'm not sure what I'm told is the right thing to do. Correct. I hear that. It feels wrong for me to behave the same as I have in the past. I've changed. Was this really the right thing to do? Huh? Or have I once again made a terrible mistake? We'll Only time will tell the tale. My duty remains to be by your side, Princess. 
Hustle up! Sounds like they've caught on to our escape. Pile in, everyone. I've got this. What's our plan to crush those cocks? I just finished formulating the strategy. Okay. Yeah, but you're a nut job. <laughs> Why would we trust hurting. your plan? The nut jobs are the ones we're fighting. Especially that scientist behind everything. I'm gonna waste his ass first. Yeah, not putting a bomb in his head was After crazy. taking a peek into your mind, I see you need to keep visiting the gates to pick up a signal for your bombs. So if I gotta block the gates, he's an expert strategist too. I do hope that your silly attempts to outthink me will at least provide some amusement. They picked an interesting main villain. Mm -hmm. Got to really think outside the box, which is doable for this crew um, because they are wild. Like they're unpredictable. That's what makes them dangerous, right? Deadshot doesn't miss, but can't hit what you can't touch because he's shielded all the time by Enchantress. Right. I believe they're going to have to try to reason with Enchantress to stop her from protecting him because if he don't have no shield, he can be killed. Um... She already saved them. That's why the bullets, I think, were glowing green. He shot them, but she stopped the bullets. She doesn't completely agree with what he's doing yet. She seems conflicted. She doesn't want to go back to Argus, but I don't think she believes in just mass murdering all these people because there's a good and bad side to Enchantress. She's cursed, not evil. Um, so, yeah. Interesting. Um, and then, yeah, there's Killer Croc who jumped Nana away, but. I think in a fair fight, one on one, I think King Shark can take Killer Croc. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't want to tussle with either of them, but I, I believe. I mean, see, Killer Croc is a bit more intelligent, though. Nana Way is at least in this version, he's a little dim with it. So, but I, I know he can be a fierce fighter. He ain't king of the sharks for nothing. Like, yeah. So, and sharks are just naturally aggressive fighters. I, a shark would be a an, an crocodile any day of the week so it just he just was getting jumped by that other fish giant creature and yeah that took him off guard and then he wasn't having time to heal but right. i definitely think he can um beat them he didn't die so there's that um but no that was a good fight i'm definitely excited to see them go against one another but yeah it's hard because they're enhanced metahumans enchantress herself is so powerful thinker himself his mind is great um, Amanda not taking better precautions when she sent some heavy hitters in is crazy. Right, and then she sent them all together. Like, are, right. you, are you kidding me? That was a powerful squad. So, whew, I don't know what she was thinking with that one. Um, I feel like they weren't thinking the right way. No. But, yeah, Thinker got in their head, made them start doubting themselves. And, yeah, now everybody's trying to figure out what they're about to do. But Peacemaker seems to have a plan, so I guess we'll just figure that out. And then we had that katana person. I mean, it looked like katana, but it also looked like a different costume in here. So I don't know yeah. what that's about. But katana had rescued Ratcatcher. So I'm not sure what that's about either. So, but she ain't popped back up since that one appearance. Um, so, yeah, I'm not sure where this is going, but it should be interesting. I don't know if they're going to try to set up a season two. I don't know if the story is going to end with season one. I don't know anything. So we're just going to keep going and see what they got in these final four episodes. Yeah. All right. Thank you guys for watching. Of course, let me know what you guys thought. Be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Thank you for watching. And we'll see you guys for more Suicide Squad Isekai. Bye.